Okay, um, here we are on a property in Gargrave in Skipton. This is a pre-war built property, as you can see a lovely stone house. And what we're looking at now is a good example of how black ash mortar accelerates corrosion and is, is responsible for corrosion even in houses where the galvanised protection is relatively good. Um, so we've got a nice example here, this wall actually, front elevation. Um, I've already exposed the tie and we're going to look at it with this boroscope. Um, here we go. There you are, you can see that the tie there is um, in excellent condition. It's actually um, galvanised, good galvanising. Um, Although it's well over 70 years old, it's actually in excellent condition. So we're not going to be recommending any media work at all on this. If we now go around the back of the property, this house is constructed um, with a rendered rear elevation, rendered in sand cement, and the builders decided that it could use black ash mortar for that elevation, um, which would be cheaper. And perhaps the architect didn't want him to use black ash mortar on the other elevations. And so this is a good opportunity to check ties in the same house, probably from the same batch, and see what, how they differ. If we look at the back, you might be able to just make out that there's a little bit of horizontal cracking. Uh, again, between those windows, similar problem. And between the windows of the neighbour. So I've already exposed a tie here for inspection, um, which I'll, you'll find interesting because you'll see here we've got a tie probably of the same age, maybe even from the same box of ties that the builder brought to site originally. And just let that white balance settle down there, you see. So there you've got a very rusty tie, but actually it's well galvanised. All that's happening, the outer leaf, you can see the tie turns a little bit dark where the galvanising's decaying, then bright white. Um, that's the zinc oxide, and then of course really rusty. And actually, if we look above, you can maybe not make out there's a horizontal crack there in the bed joint. So that's a good illustration of how black ash mortar is um, a cause of wall tie corrosion and does actually worsen it by a considerable degree. So there you are.